All right, we are here. We are inside the aforementioned Rolling Mansion. This is part of the Fall Boat and RV Show, the Indianapolis Fall RV and Boat Show, or Boat and RV Show. This is uh, an RV, Brandon Moore, that is... uh, Taking my breath away. Ah, thank you. Yeah, it does that to me too. So this is a 2023 Integra Coach Anthem 44B, right? And this is something that's got a 450 horsepower diesel engine, right? A six-speed Allison transmission. It can tow 15,000 pounds, right? All hardwood cabinetry, all real tile floors, heated tile floors. Mm-hmm. Um, this is something that's going to be pretty much the pinnacle of luxury when it comes to the RV industry. Yeah, when we stepped on it, I was honestly looking for the Rolling Stones because I thought ah. we were stepping onto their tour bus. I mean, this is... This is literally, you, you could just, this is, this is luxury on wheels. Yeah, yeah, welcome home. That's exactly what it's designed for, right? People who like to full-time uh, snowbirds who like to head around the country and just follow the warmer weather, those sorts of things. It's all about that. So you're going to have things like you're going to have an on-demand water heater, like I said, heated tile floors. It's going to give you all the amenities of home, washer and dryer, while being able to drive down the highway and take your family wherever you want to go on vacation. I'd be remiss if I didn't bring Mitch Renfro in here. Now, Mitch, this is just one of many things we can see throughout the weekend, kicking off Friday through Sunday. Yep. Give us a sense of what we'll see when we come out to the fairgrounds. Yeah, so exactly. This is a great example of the very high end, but they also we have the pull behind campers, the regular runabout boats, pontoons, everything that you're looking for. And the best thing about this show is the difference between the February and the, this one is we do have used products as well. So if you're in the market for a used boat and RV, we've got them there at the show. And, and can I actually um, make a commitment to, to make a purchase at the show itself when I'm there, or is it just oh, yeah. a... Yeah, that's a big thing we talk about with this show is this is an, like a blowout sale. It's the best time to buy your boat and RV. If you don't buy now, you're going to pay too much. Um, and and let's, let's get back t- to this, Brandon. Uh, this, who is your demographic for um, – I mean, this just seems like luxury on steroids. Oh, absolutely, it is, right? The demographic, like I said, is going to be a lot of those snowbirds, those sorts of things, love a motorhome like this, or people who like to take something like this out across the country four or five times a year as compared to taking a family vacation, right? And that's, you know, who we are as Coleraine Family RV, as you were talking about purchases at the actual show, right? You can come see us at the RV show. So um, we'll have this, along with 35 other campers, actually at the RV show this weekend, available for purchase. Um, And we also have a location over in the southeast side of Indianapolis off of 465. So any customer who comes down that way can purchase one there, too. But, yeah, RV show, big Big thing going on this weekend, best deals of the year. So a, a guy with more modest tastes might be able to get something with maybe sort of a pop-up camper that I could pull with my pickup? Yeah, great question, 100%, right? So we run the gamut, right? We've got big luxury stuff like this all the way down to things that may run in the $10,000 range, right? We've got uh, travel trailers anywhere from your entry level to luxury stuff that'll be in the ten to $20,000 range. We've got stuff in the 30s, 40s, and 50s, and we've got fifth wheels as simple and as luxury as you might like to get all the way up to toy haulers that are, you know, 45 feet with generators and three air conditioners and 14-foot garages. We run the gambit on that kind of stuff. And the show kicks off Friday, runs through Sunday, and I would be remiss if I didn't point out that there are going to be a whole lot of boats out there as well, folks. The show is this weekend at the fairgrounds.